I wanted to start off saying you guys are awesome. Thank you uh, so much for 9 million subscribers. I know I've probably said that in more than one video, but just I can't thank you enough. And also, the first part of Hours of Darkness, I think we hit like 30,000 likes. If we had something like that on this, expect it quickly. Uh, they also sent me, or they're actually sending me in the process to give away to you guys was a Steelbook version of the game for PS4. And then I think it's either an Xbox or PS4 Hope County Collector's Edition. It's the huge one. It's like a few hundred bucks. So, anyways, Lost on Mars, second expansion. I got really excited when I saw that they added both of these at the same time onto the menu, at least. I like the uh, three little emblems as well. The hand coming up, then you get the astronaut helmet. I had to click on it. It's not available yet, guys. That's going to be the last one. All right, let's do this, guys. some errands for the wife and kiddo. Cool, 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 cool. No doubt. So listen, man. Remember that time a couple years back we got hammered off party liquor, spread eagle, and I made you promise that if I was ever seduced by a super hot, super intelligent being of dubious moral standing who whisked me away to an exotic land, well, that you'd come and help a brother out. Uh, vaguely. Well, bro, sis, you better buckle up because that time has arrived. Oh, shit! <laughs> I really don't have time for this. But dude, you made a promise. Do you even know what a promise is? That's like a sacred pact, man. That no hey, man shit, man. Come on, get you, stupid gal. Herc, look, can whatever you need wait until tomorrow? I'm gonna go with the big N-O on that, compadre, because this is one of them uh, life or death things that I sometimes get myself into through no fault of my own. All right, fine. I'll help. Where do you need me to go? Uh, well, it's a little far. Don't worry. I get you here in the jiffy. What the fuck does that mean? Hurt? Uh, what the? Look, just hold on and try not to vomit. Oh, and if you got a six pack on you, go grab it now. Hurt? What the hell is going on? Oh, no, 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 situation is, uh, rather dire. But just head through the doors, man. I'll explain everything in a minute. Alright, so this already has more story than the, uh, Hours of Darkness or whatever whoa, it was called. Whoa. The what fact the that we're playing as Nick Rye was kind of surprising. I don't know how they were going to do this. kind of want to explore a little bit. Got the zero gravity Come thing on, going on, man, you know? That's really cool. Alright. Let's go through the door. The start of this reminded me of the original Prey. Look, I ain't making your the cane, one that, Miko, that there's the very some first one. Shit. What you is get abducted this place, by aliens huh? at the start. What am I doing here? Look, man, okay, there ain't always a logical explanation of these things. Sometimes you just find yourself, like, in a space station with little to no context or backstory. You just gotta fucking roll with it, man. So, less questions and more movement, Nicholas, because if you don't save us, we all gonna die. What? Me? What the fuck are you talking about? 
I like how he was running errands for his wife and kid, because I think they had the kid I for that movie, God, not the I'm movie, but the, uh, the mission oh, special God. delivery. It's so weird to be able to jump like that. Well, I saw that red icon in there, but I can't get to it. Uh, can you go through here? When the world? You see his head? Oh, shit! Oh man, dude, I am so happy to see you too. Now I know what you're thinking. Where's my junk? But as important as the answer is to that question, we got bigger fish to fry. Firstly, let me explain what's going on. You are now on Mars. Welcome. Now, imagine my arms are outstretched to comfort you during said revelation. Why are you on Mars? To save the Earth, man. What from? An alien invasion. Yeah, that's right, man, an alien invasion, Miko. Now, I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. It's not gonna be us who are doing the actual saving of Earth. It's gonna be mostly Anne, that Anne. The AI super being that Larry Parker would not stop talking about, you remember? Only problem is, man, these aliens took over the entire planet. They messed with her network, man, and she has come undone. And we need to get her back, man. So how do we return Anne to this beautiful, majestic, Earth-saving butterfly she once was? by finding energy cores and using them to power up all the terminals in the network, man. It's a simple plan, don't worry. Gotta get moving, though, man. There's a couple energy core thingies over yonder, man. I'll show you how this works. Go get them. Energy Yo, cores? This is... Alien invasion? What the fuck, Kirk? I didn't ask for this. Look, I'm sorry, man, okay? But you're not the only person whose life has been turned upside down for far-fetched and highly suspect reasons, okay? I mean, look at me. If anyone's a victim here, it's me, the Herkster. Now, I don't want any part of this. I just want to go back to my family. No can do, amigo. We use that last bit of juice to get you up here. Besides, if you don't power up Anne's terminals, you won't have a family to go back to. Getting some alien isolation vibes right now. All right, I think I went the wrong way. I gotta go back the other side. Yeah, this was completely different from what I thought it would be. Let's see all the different options. I got the weapon will still. Okay. Here we go. I got a bad feeling, guys. I'm playing this on PC just like I did the last DLC. It's the only way I was able to get it early. Oh, look at the eye. It looks like an eye, doesn't it? That's it, man. That's the energy core. Bring it back and put it inside the terminal. So, you brought me all the way to Mars to... Turn the power back on? Well, don't say it like that, man. You take all the pizzazzy out of it. And if you guys don't remember, Larry was the... I guess the... I would call him a mad scientist. He was a scientist where there was actually a, a way you could see glimpses of Mars before uh, the DLC even dropped out. He got, like, teleported in the main store. I bet we see Control him in this DLC. Restored. It worked! See? Nick? This is Ann. Ann, meet my bro Nick. Uh. Hi? Nicholas Rye. You are Earth's last hope. And me too, right? An arachnid force millions of years in the making threatens your world. But with your help, I can stop them. Yeah. Herc filled me in on that part. We turn on the terminals and restore your power and stop the alien invasion. Is there anything I'm missing here? No. Why do you ask? I don't know. It just seems pretty simple for something not so simple. You'd think there'd be more to it. No. It is very straightforward. <clears throat> okay, man. All systems are a go. Let's get down to business. You're gonna need to be able to defend yourself out here. You see the green barrels around here? Grab what's inside them. All right, loot the barrels. I know it just feels like space jizz or something, but... Well, we have currency. magic, Miko. Harvest is straight from the aliens. It makes all sorts... Let me check something really quick. Hold on, journal. Let me just take a look at what we got. Is there its... So, is this like its own... You have Herc misses so side missions. Oh, so you can actually... Yeah. This is a full-fledged game inside this. So, it's kind of like the Vietnam DLC. Hours of Darkness was, uh... It was different. It was almost like just one giant mission. Whereas this seems more like it's going to have parts, you know? When you're done, man, take some of your space jizz over that 3D print machine over there and I'll show you a cool trick. 
What? Use a 3D printer. Is this like a nod to uh, Watch Dogs 2? Items, weapons? Yo, it kind of is, isn't it? Blaster of... Hold on, let me see these other names. The Obliterator with four R's. Nut Hugger, Laser Blazer, Taser, Spazer, Annihilator, Morphinator, Punches in the Bunches. Yo, it's it's full. It's a full-fledged game inside this. Let me see the items. Space bandages. Let's buy a gun or print one. Ah, uh, let's just keep it there. That's fine. Everyone likes that. See how that works, man? Space kids, firearms. Yes. The more my systems are restored, the more tools I can provide to obliterate any and all life forms who stand in our way. Uh, what do you mean, all life forms? Oh, you'll see when we get outside. We? Yeah, man, I ain't gonna let you haul all the glory for saving the world. This here's a partnership. Now, come on. Grab my head, dude. We got work to do. Collect Herc's head. Man, this is not happening. Get a grip, Nicholas, because your brain's about to go kablooey, man. I think it's funny how they've, uh... I mean, it's more comedic than I thought it would be, even though you're trying to save the world, you know? My antenna are scattered across the landscape. Turning them on will help restore my functionality and help you on your journey. Let's get going over here. What was that? Oh, shit. What was that? Relax, man. It's just Mars, you know? A little bit nervous about this planet. Reminds me of the first Mass Effect. Wait, 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 man. Stay off that dirt. What? Oh, my God. What is Space that? Crab, man. Ooh. Shoot it. Shoot it, please. Don't oh my goodness. stop me, man. I'm defenseless. There's no reload. It's just a cooldown. What is this? Nice. Watch out! There's more! Are you Come kidding? On, Nick. I know you can do it, buddy. Oh my god, this thing's bigger than the other one. My instinct is to reload. Are they dead? They're still moving around. Yo, I don't know if you guys have ever seen it, but if you haven't, check it out. It's a uh, movie called Edge of Tomorrow. Well, actually, I think it's Live Die Repeat. Is this just like an endless enemy thing? Oh my god. I gotta be careful. Oh no 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 no. Just keep keep running. Keep running. I don't think I'm supposed to fight everything. We can't find the other energy cores unless we power the antenna. Fuck, man. Oh, man. Look, man, some stuff ain't as advanced out here as it is in Montana, for which I apologize, okay? All right. It can be looted from green storage barrels found all over the planet. It can also be looted directly from those things. Okay, that's the thing I've been picking up. That's a little icon. Require that to get new weapons. Okay. So it's like one big currency for everything. Collection, killing enemies, collecting off their bodies. This is all one currency. Nice. Maybe this DLC is not as long as I'm thinking it's going to be. I would like it to be a good, uh, a I good link for... I thought my days for... of shit was over after I left Kyra, but here we are, man. How am I supposed to get up there again? Is this laser... So that lady's gonna kill us, probably. I gotta be careful. Uh, I guess we could head this way. Is that the climb stuff? Oh, I see it right here. Here we go. I thought my days of climbing shit was over after I left Kyrat, but here we are, man. I already like this better than the Hours of Darkness. Not really because... I guess it's just more of the, uh... 
There's more of a story to this one. The other one was just like you rescued your friends. Man, I, I totally forgot to friends. mention those space crabs. They live underground. That that one's on me, man. I'm, I'm so sorry. That's my bad. You're sorry? You want to tell me what that was all about? Man, ain't you ever seen Tremors? These space crab dudes, they tear through dirt the exact same way. I'm telling you, man. I hope you got a good look, man, because they're the invaders, okay? They're the ones we need to stop. He just mentioned Tremors. Aaron was telling My me life complete they're now. gonna use her technology to invade the Earth and turn all the humans into food. Isn't that crazy? Exactly. Humans will become nothing more than food to sustain the Arachnid Horde as it spreads through the galaxy. Are you sure? Because, I mean, they don't look all that smart to me. Well, they are. These little bastards, they've been playing keep away with the energy core so Aaron can't get back online. So if we're gonna get those energy cores back, you can bet that these little bastards are gonna be all in our face about it. Can I make this jump? It's like the highest point right here. Oh, are we good? Nice. It's working! Antenna restored. Functionality increased. Excellent, Nick. Thank you for your assistance. You may now consult your map to locate other energy cores in this area. Control center antenna. Is that it? Oh wait, the 3D printer, I forgot. They're all over the place. Thing is, I need to save up for... for our 8th Universal Blueprint to unlock that. What? <laughs> Did I just do that? Oh yeah, let me check something really quick. Can you are you supposed to save it? Looks like it's an auto save type situation. You got terminal missions, you don't have to accept any type of mission for some Find somebody exploring the surface of Mars. Herc missions, side missions. I would like to actually oh, man, explore those because two right there? That looks like the spot where I was attacked by a big ass space crab. I am picking up a signal from your gravity belt nearby. It will improve mobility, remove fall damage, and allow you to reach the transference center. No. No way, my space jets are still working, dude! Dude, my space jets are still working! Okay, let's go find them, man. Once you acquire the gravity belt, go to the transference center. What the hell's transference? Transference is the future. It's plugging my consciousness into a robot killing machine like I'm at 209. Transference is the future. Yeah, yeah, we get it, Ann. Oh, man, she's been trying to make me forget about finding my human body, so I'll just live life in a robot body. But I got a good feeling, man. I'm staying positive. I'm gonna take some fall damage from that. Yeah, it's fine. Man, these enemies are relentless. Oh, I gotta get in here. Disengaging door lock. Please wait. Oh, dang, is that... Is that my hand? Well, who else's hand would it be, dummy? You know, I'm tempted to go back and buy some, uh... His right hand. We're putting him back together, Fair guys. Boy, man, I'm just not meant to be prepared to accept the possibility that something really bad has happened to my childless dad bod. Herx, hold on, what is this? Hold on, I, I, I gotta see this, hold on. Got the volumes, you got Herx body. So, how do you, there's, okay, so there's gonna be, uh, 12 different things you can get. I kinda wanna check something, hold on one sec, guys. My scans indicate several more organic anomalies. Oh, come on, you serious? My body's in a bunch ah. of pieces? Oh, man, how are we gonna find them all? With transference, you will gain the ability to... I can get out of here, yo. Here and now, I'm gonna promise you, hey, we will find my body parts. We'll be back together like Humpty Dumpty, because there ain't no point in saving the world. We're not food. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I need to go make some healing. I'm trying to save up for a better weapon because I don't really like this one too much. Okay, just like Ann said, we need to find the space jets I was using. Can't get to the transference center without them. 
All right, sand, walk on the ground is safe as long as you can stay off the sand. Look for rocky terrain. Yo, they are taking the, uh... The exact plot from Tremors. Watch your step, so man, sick. and remember, the sand is bad. You gotta stay on rock. In the movie, they had to, like, pole vault to each rock to try to avoid, like, the loose soil and stuff. Or I guess, in this case, the Mars, uh, sand, if you would. So I just stay along this side. They can't get me. And I'm guessing those hard surfaces, it's kind of like the floor is lava, basically. Damn! I don't know Looks if you guys like played that when you were a kid. There. Oh, can we I make it? Those space jets. Oh shit, that's my pelvic area! Big ass space crab did me dirty! Oh, here we go. All right, gravity belt gives you better mobility in the air. Hold it and activates the sound. Oh, wow, okay. Hold on. Oh, Wait. man. Where's my junk? Nick, Nick, where's my junk? You can hover. Nick, you are lucky you've never had to go through this, man. Nick, I'm telling you, there is no worse feeling than thinking you found your dismembered member only to realize it's your peckerless pelvis. Come on, man, a little sympathy. This is really nice, the fact that we got a kind of a mini jetpack, I guess you would. Can I go up there with this? Oh, that's so sick. <laughs> it's like the wingsuit now. Dismembered. Completed. Now what? Can I make this jump? Here we go. We gotta find the rest of me, Nick. From my temples to my taint to my toes, man. All of me, okay? And then Anne can turn me into a real boy again. Her, what you're saying isn't possible. No way, Jose. You shoot a big enough load of that space jizz in the Anne's 3D printer and anything is possible. Nonsense, Herc. With transference, you'll become something greater than man. You will become immortal. Indestructible. You will be perfect. What? Hey, the weak point, obviously, is the back. While there is truth to that statement, I gotta be honest with you, I am on the temporary train. I don't expect you to understand the joys of humanity, the pleasures of the flesh, the delights of the senses, the takings of a monstrous dumb. Why can't you can just farm the enemies, you know? I think I killed all of them. I think. I could be wrong. Come on, man. Do you want me to be a cyber killing machine and fulfill my destiny or not? It's hard to hit the top of though. I'm trying to get all the loot. Man, this is a lot of fun. Like, I actually hope to do all the side missions they have for this as well. So if you hover, you just stay in one spot, but it's like you can go back and forth. You got complete control, too. That's really nice. I'm going down. Listen, man, I get it. You're afraid if I become a robot, I'll try to kill you, but I promise I won't. I'm gonna be a good robot, like RTD2, but with a machine gun. <laughs> a weird being like floating around everywhere in a Far Cry game, you know? I like this DLC already a lot better than the last one. The other one wasn't bad ever. Like, it just, this just has more to it. It's, it's more comedic, it's more. Easy going, fun. We're also on Mars, so that actually helps out a lot. I feel like even though you're saving the world, it doesn't. It's not like a serious matter, you know? My emotions, Weird. Man, it is the only thing I have left. Now let's get to the transference center. It's one of those things, isn't it? Hold on, let me check. Space bandages. All right. I saw that down there and I wanted to go get it. I don't know if it's a smart move or not. I'm sure Matt Matt Damon somewhere on this planet. What was he like a botanist? Is that what it was? Am 
my thing is, I feel like they also set this up kind of like I wanted the last DLC, where it was, you kind of do whatever you want. Granted, you also are, are doing the story as you go, but you can do other things, and it also increases that overall percentage. I think we're at like 10% right now. I don't know if that, when that gets to 100, will that be... Oh, God. That's like where it's the end of the game. Fight maybe a giant alien, like a huge boss. I have no idea. Explosive grenade Ooh. acquired. Uh, just like Earth grenades, but better because space. I love it. <laughs> you can print them too, so I guess after you get an item, then you can actually make it in the printer. Transference center. Oh man, I'm starting to get real excited now. I cannot believe that in just a few minutes, I'm gonna be a cold, uncaring, cybernetic death monster. It's gonna be sweet, man. It's gonna be sweet. Herc was one of my favorite, uh, gun Guns for Hire in the actual main story. That rocket launcher was so vicious in every scenario. Granted, he would kill himself a lot, or take himself out. I'm just like happy that this DLC turned out to be good. I'm, I'm kind of glad that they made each one different. I, I was kind of, I don't know if it's going to be like a rescue mission on Mars this time or what. So that kind of makes me excited for that final one with the zombies. All right, yeah. Get around. Throw a few enemies out. Get out. Get some currency or whatever this is. Swap weapons? To what? I don't have anything else, I thought. It's like you can interact with this stuff, but you can't. Alright, some more health. Space bandages. It's like they made everything like the regular game. They just added the word space to it. Okay, the terminal is on the top floor. You gotta power that place up before we can use the transference chamber. You fly like the wind now, little monkey. Monkeys don't fly, Herc. Not with that attitude, they don't. I didn't know if they might have added, so that's when I tapped it just to try, but... Grenade doesn't affect them when they're under the ground, apparently. Awesome, oh, the barrel over there. There's actually a couple over here, never mind. I'm gonna grab everything I can. Uh, I don't know if I'll go for the 100%. I guess I'll just see how the video does and if you guys would like me to explore as much as I can while doing the story and everything, I definitely will. Now let me grab this one as well. Space bandage is full. Damn. All right, so we gotta head up. We're not too far away. Let me go back around again. I just wanted to collect all the different things I saw. Can you go in here? What's this? Getting that alien isolation vibe just a little bit. Right, how do you get up there? I see something right there. Hold on the wall. Let me see what this is. Shield acquired. Oh, we got a shield. How are we supposed to get over there? Is it maybe I have to go outside right here? This might be the right way. Oh, I think it is. where I'm going. <laughs> I'm like on the outside, but I thought that was it. Fuck, you gotta climb this. Yeah, it's, it's not the right way. Hold on. So I got on top of the whole facility. I think I'm gonna try to get... I think, you, I think that's what you're supposed to do. There we go. Nice. Transfer 
transference center restored. You can now use the transference chamber. The two of you working as a team will greatly increase our team. All right, teleporter. Uh, make it able to fast travel to the other teleporters you've unlocked. This okay. Is a success. Team Cat Bros for life. Put me in, dude. Put me in. 3D printer. Hold on. How much do I have? Oh, I can get a beam gun. 450 for that. Uh, all the other items. Thing is, I can get more grenades and stuff, but is it really necessary? Because I feel like everything else you can just get on the ground, you know? Oh, they have rifles as well? Hold on. Recharge rate. I don't know which one I want to get. I, You know what? Let's get the big one. I should be able to have two of them. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no. I just messed something up. Hold on. Let me see. Do I have that? Can I swap to it? Hold on, that's weird. Alright guys, I had to go ahead and put this back in there too. Just so I can swap between two of them. I think I'll do... Yeah, I'm going to have these two. Because you have to get them... Where you swap back and forth, just like the main game. Robot. Alright, put Herc's head inside the, <laughs> the chamber over here. Oh, here we go. Look out, man! Big ass space crab! Oh my goodness. Big ass space crab. That's her! That's her! That is the space crab! What stole my privates, man? I know. I'd recognize that ugly face anywhere. Oh my goodness. You're the reason this my gun's amazing, though. around the sand somewhere looking like a gigantic breaded chicken cutlet. Did I get him? No, I didn't. Oh boy. Yes! Oh my goodness, you did it, man. You did it. You avenged me and my wiener. That's brotherly love, man. Now put me in for real, and, and don't forget to take my head. We'll need it to complete the awkward human puzzle I've become. For real this time. <sighs> this gun's really nice. Full full auto and everything. Channel now. Don't mess up my goatee. What? It's gonna go over here. Some theme music. He has a bandana on. That's awesome. Robot completed. You can have a robot for high. Hold on. Oh, you got roster in this game. Stupid but dangerous. The power of music. The best DJ on Mars. Best DJ on Mars. Robot comes equipped with a catalog of tunes to help set the mood. He has the EMP as well. That is kind of sick, actually. Is that it? Hold on, let me see where we're going now. I guess we could just honestly go anywhere. See, oh, it's okay. Now now I can see it. So, 15%. Queen's killed. 0-15. Herc's body. Clutch Nixon's challenge is completed. Okay. Larry's notes. Red. Uh, we got a long way to go, it seems like. This is actually really cool. I didn't think it would be like a full-fledged game inside this game, you know? All right, man. You still got an energy. All right, buddy. Brace yourself. You're about to pop a bro boner here. Check it out. Your bad boy Robocop here is fitted with a whole punch of lasers that these spacecraft don't stand no chance against. And this sexy, delicious, rock-hard body was built to last all kinds of physical and verbal abuse. We're linked up, man, so you can just tell me where to go and I'll follow, man. 
I won't even argue like ever. Unless you say something about monkeys. And if we find ourselves in a pickle and shit gets real intense, you just use me, man. I'll draw these suckers away with my jaw-dropping dance moves and such. Now, I know you're impressed with how impressive I've become, but don't let how impressive I am distract you from the fact that we gotta give our human compadres the heroes they deserve. We need to find more energy cores, man. I think there's another antenna nearby, so let's go. Hurt? Just how the hell did you get mixed up in all this? Man, that's not important. What is important is that you understand how much danger we're all in because I didn't, okay? I fucked up. I, I, I didn't really realize. I tried to impress him by taking care of this all myself and where to get me? I got my damn body snatched and sprinkle all the damn Mars. It's probably my fault for telling her that I was Earth's greatest champion. Disappearing act? What is this? Champion, I see that I don't want to go now, invisible yet. On, I, was, I was trying to get some. So all I'm trying to tell you, Nick, is that you can't be a dummy about this, okay? You can't be thinking you're some new hot kid on the block. You gotta stay humble, man. Stay focused. You gotta be smart, man. Like, old hurt you. you hear yourself? I'm stuck doing this because you're not smart. You're actually really, really dumb, Herc. I was dumb, Nick. I was dumb. Past tense. And for like a very short period of time, I'm fucking 17 seconds max. And that's way less time than most people spend being dumb, which is a scientific fact. Which means that it is scientifically impossible for me to do anything dumb for like a long, long time, man. Like statistically, that's a fact. Right? 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 Nick? I think this is really awesome how they did this DLC. I now now I kind of wonder which Far Cry character is gonna be thrown into the zombie. You know, one. I think I'm, I'm not. I can't remember who it was that was from the main game in Hours of Darkness. I'm trying to remember the exact character it was. It was like somebody's family member. I can't remember who it was. There goes my graphics card. All right, I think once I get up here, I'll probably stop the video. But if you guys want more quickly, just do what you do, man. Destroy that like button. All the love and everything really just greatly appreciated. And I just really can't thank you enough for, uh... I mean, I've heard... We're on the road to the... What is it? The diamond play button now? Never thought I would actually say those words. It's crazy. I got, like, a college diploma, and then I got the million subscriber plaque or whatever. All right, man. Same deal as last time. Get to the it's top like, and power that terminal. Like, I'm more proud of the subscriber one, honestly. <laughs> it's crazy. All right, here we go. Oh, queen eggs. You know what? These areas are like an outpost, almost. Trying to collect all the stuff I can. I don't think after a while I'm going to need to collect everything, but since it's still early on, I want to get all the weapons I can. See these things right here? Well, let's go up top. If we hey, can. Hey, this kind of fun. Oh, just embrace it, man. See, there's a chance to test yourself. And to test those space jets. Come on, man. Beware the stabilizer cores. Touching them will cause severe harm to any organic matter. Sucks for you, buddy, that you're made out of all that organicness. Too bad you don't have a sweet killer robot outfit like I do. Transference is the future. Robots never age, never decay, never rot. Robots oh, are boy. forever. Do you desire transference, Nick Rye? No. Uh, no. It's okay, I'm good. Grab some of them eggs, man. Their crab moans will come in handy. So what exactly is going to happen once Ant's power is restored? As you restore power to my terminals, you will in turn help me regain control of my network. My robot army will power back on and assist you in fending off the arachnid horde. Wait, robot army? Once I regain full control, I will direct my robots to the launcher, where they will travel to Earth and intercept the arachnid invasion. Jesus. I know, man. It's going to be awesome. Her. That sounds terrifying. There's alternate ways to get up top, because you can kind of jump on those things, but they do a lot of damage to you. That's kind of what I just dealt with a minute ago. I'd rather not. I think I'm going to have to in a minute, though. Up to now, I think it's been kind of optional, but... Oh, man. I guess what I would have to do, it looks like... Can I make that? I mean, does that... It connects up there. Let's try it. Oh boy, hold on. But I, 
can just go up there. Forget how much reach this thing has. Look at that. I don't even need anything else. We're good. Oh, here we go. Easy does it. Nice. Whoa, okay, hang on, man. I got all kinds of shit flashing up in my eyes here. What the hell is this? I've uploaded the locations of your body parts to your map. All right, Midnight Mountain's antenna restored. Antenna C1 restored. Energy core locations updated. Yeah, 20%. Nice. All right, guys, on that Sweet. note. I'm picking on. up a reading now. Near that energy core. Let's check it out, man. No stone left unturned, know what I mean? I gotta say, Ann, I'm touched. Because I know you're not super on board with the idea of me being human again. I have had enough discussions with you, Herc, to know that appealing to you with logic and reason is pointless. Oh, man. That is really nice of you to say. You really get me. Herc. Shouldn't we be focusing on saving the world? Nick Rye is correct. We are. I just want to take a peek, okay? All right, guys. I love you all. If you want the next part, just keep doing what you're doing. Uh, you guys are awesome, and I will catch you soon. Take it easy, guys.